is the real deal. This isn't your ski resort. So pay attention. If you get hung up on the mountain and you need help, we'll we'll figure out some sort of hand signal. But you know, or if you wreck really bad and you need us to come get you, start waving your hands. Otherwise, we're gonna assume you're gonna get up and keep riding. But yeah, yeah. here's the deal. We come in, I gotta send my team onto the side of the mountain through the rocks to come get you. It puts us at puts my guys at risk and I don't want to do that, okay? But we will, that's what we're here for. But it also slows the venue comp down. We start running out of time, we're late in the day kind of thing. So ski control, let's not let's have a nice, good, fun, safe event. Let's showcase your talent. You guys are amazing riders, but let's do it responsibly, right? That's what we're here for. Respect. Respect Mama Chugach, if you would. So there's some talk around camp that the Olympic race boy couldn't hang in the backcountry. Now I love myself a little challenge. It was on. At some level you have to have a screw loose to even set foot on these lines. After the conditions just continued to get worse and safety crews decided that they weren't going to sanction the event, we decided that the show must go on and do a peer judged event based on video. Trying to decide which line you were going to take turned into a gamble. Some found good snow, some found nothing but ice. That's backcountry riding for you. My first run was alright, I mean, I had fun, but I knew if I wanted to leave my mark at tailgate, I needed to push myself way beyond my level of comfort. And I'm not the only one